in how many ways can a batsman score exactly 25 runs by scoring single runs fours and sixes only irrespective of the sequence of scoring shots here a batsman should score 25 runs either by scoring singles or by scoring fours or by scoring sixes here he can score all these three or either of these two that is by scoring ones and fours or by scoring fours and sixes or by scoring ones and sixes but he should exactly make 25 runs here i will use number of sixes to find out the number of ways to score this 25 runs here this batsman should score 25 runs and number of maximum sixes he can score is 4 because 6 into 4s are 24 so here i will take number of six as the cases in the first case i will take number of six as maximum that is four because 25 runs is possible so four into six is equal to 24 so remaining score will be 25 minus six into four 24 that is equal to one that means number of fours will be zero that is number of ways will be one because this batsman can score four sixes and one single that will become 25 runs then again in the next case number of sixes is equal to 3 that means remaining score is equal to 25 minus 3 into 6 is equal to 18 that is equal to 7 that means number of fours will become either 0 or 1 that means number of ways is equal to 2 here number of ways is equal to 2 means Either the batsman can score 3 sixes and 7 singles or he can score 3 sixes, 1, 4 and 3 singles. That is 2 ways. Next, in the third case, number of sixes will be 2. That means remaining score is equal to 25 minus 12 is equal to 30. That means number of fours can be either 0 or 1 or 2 or 3 because 3 into 4 is equal to 12. So, number of ways will be 4 that is either he can score 2 sixes and 13 singles or he can score 2 sixes 1 4 and 13 minus 4 singles or he can score 2 sixes 2 fours and 13 minus 8 singles or he can score 2 sixes 3 fours and 13 minus 12 singles that's why here in this case four ways are there In the fourth case, that is, number of sixes is equal to 1. That means, remaining score is equal to 25 minus 6 is equal to 90. That means, number of fours can be either 0 or 1 or 2 or 3 or 4. And that means, number of ways is equal to 5 here. Same way, in the fifth case, number of sixes can be 0. That means remaining score is equal to 25 itself. That is, number of fours can be, in that case, number of fours can be 0, 1, 2, or 3, or 4, or 5, or 6. 6 fours are 24. That means number of ways is equal to 6 plus 1. 7 here that means total number of ways here total number of ways is equal to total number of ways is equal to 1 plus 2 1 plus 2 plus 4 plus 5 plus 7 that is equal to 1 plus 2 3 3 plus 4 7 7 plus 5 12 12 plus 7 19 so, total number of ways is equal to 19. Option B is your answer.